Hey there, Zonfire here, and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. So, uh, right now we got a few skill points, so let's get those knocked out of the way real fast. Food duration will last longer, which is nice. And craft faster. Not going to complain about that. Now, uh, Right now, all the quests we have to do require being able to fly, which we're not able to do so. But we will be able to at some point through the main story, so let's go ahead and open this fucking door. We're still using the, uh, we're still making our armor look like the, Karja Stalker, but, again, you can just change them on the fly. So we'll change this because, it'll be nice to change it, because, since we've, I've noticed that. I don't know if that's always been available, so it may have been an update that I just did not notice Welcome before back, I started Aloy. talking. I see you have obtained Omega clearance. Aloy, I know your experience in Thebes was unsettling, but we have a new problem. Did something go wrong with Beta and the rig? Will we be able to transport you to Gemini? The rig is complete. The problem is Hephaestus itself. It has accelerated its proliferation throughout the Cauldron Network, increasing its power. But with your subfunctions restored, we can still succeed, right? Correct. But the net effect is that absorbing Hephaestus will take longer than previously calculated. How long? Even with Omega clearance, my current estimate is that the merge will take 35 hours. And each hour increases the risk of detection by the Zeniths. Two cores. Two overrides. What if the merge were carried out by two clones of Elizabeth Sobek, both armed with Omega clearance? How long then? Half the time? Hephaestus would be unprepared for the simultaneous labor of two operators, in addition to obvious synergetic efficiencies. Calculating. It would reduce the merge time to approximately 4.5 hours. Okay. Laurel, it looks like we're gonna need Beta at Gemini. Do you think you can convince her? Uh, I don't know, but I'll try. I appreciate it, Laurel. What about our diversion? Are the pulse generators ready? Only a final test remains. I am confident that if fired in proximity to other cauldrons, the pulses will mask our activities at Gemini from the Zenith. Good. As long as Aaron can operate one without shooting himself in the face. Hey, hey, I heard that. You'd better get down here. Beta's in bad shape. Okay. Aloy. I tried, but it's impossible. I don't think anything will convince her to go. We don't have a choice. Good luck. Beta, you have to come with us. It's the only way. It's one mission. The most important one. We need you. He's gone silent. Tell me why you won't go. What if they... What if they take me back... Alone... In a cell again... A slave... Forever... This is tough because it's like, find your courage... And... 
Like Merle and I will be at Gemini too. I'll protect you. As soon as we get Hephaestus, we'll come straight back here. The Zeniths aren't going to find us. You don't have to be afraid. No! You can't protect me. Nothing can protect me from them. I told you from the beginning, we'll never beat them. It's hopeless. Beta. Leave me alone! You don't understand! You're right. I don't understand. We have the same genes, the same mind, the same heart. So why can't you find the strength to do what has to be done? Like Elizabeth would. Don't you think I've thought about that? I don't know what piece of Elizabeth I'm missing. I don't know what you have that I don't. I look through all the data from your focus. You were raised as an outcast, shunned and isolated just like me. So what's the difference? What's my defect? Trust. Beta, you don't have a defect. Beta, look, it's not a piece of Elizabeth. The difference is, I had him. Frost, he raised you, trained you, but he was never warm or loving. The day he died, the day he gave you that charm, he was going to abandon you. He wanted me to embrace the tribe. But then he gave his life for mine. He loved me in his own way. And that was enough. What did it feel like? It was like... having a strength that was always there. It's still there. Even now I hear him in my head when things get bad. But it looks impossible. Look deeper. And then fight like you can win. You don't have to go on the mission. We'll find another way. I'll go. You said you'd try to protect me. I believe you. But you have to promise me one thing. Yes, of course. If it goes bad, if the Zeniths find us, I don't want to be their slave again. Do you understand? I promise. I promise. I could use as much time as you can give me to study up on the merch to make it as efficient as possible. Uh, we're ready to go. I'll be ready when you are. I swear. going on over here new quest new quest new quest Aloy. Aloy. may we speak no 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 I think we can talk holograms Gaia I thought you said the data here was lost 
I was able to repurpose the equipment to store the data you have acquired in your travels. Well, looks like it's getting some use. What's hiding in this little file? Aloy! Right to work, I see. There's just... so much! I mean, we knew of artificial beings that served the ancestors, but Gaia? Oh, she's amazing! A and you, a true reincarnation of an ancestor. Genetically speaking, of course, not like the, um, late CEO. And there's more ancestors out there, returned from beyond the stars. Uh, of course, they're trying to kill us, which is not great. And Eric Visser is with them, which is disturbing. And then there's Hephaestus, and... Okay, okay, how about... We take it one step at a time. You're right. I also owe you an explanation for everything that happened at Landfall. Oh, and uh, if you have a moment, there's something I could use your help with. You mentioned there was something you needed help with? Yes. Uh, so, as I was sifting through data from the greenhouse, I found references to an old world system back in the Great Delta. It's called Leviathan. My people discovered it decades ago. A sprawling network of river gates and a labyrinth of underground tunnels. The legacy revealed that the old ones used it to control flooding. But we've never gotten it to work. The whole thing is shut down. But, the data from the greenhouse mentions the research facility where Leviathan was created. It's in San Francisco. Another Pharaoh facility? No. Leviathan was a project by Eileen Sasaki, another ancestor. So, the legacy tells us, anyway. If we can acquire that data, we might be able to fix the system back in the Great Delta. Every year, my sister gets terrified when the long rains begin. With Leviathan, Maybe she won't have to be. Okay. So, where in San Francisco is this facility? That's the thing. The data doesn't say where, exactly. But one of our diviners has been exploring the ruins. He might know. Would you come with me? I have a feeling that wherever this facility is... Well, you're much better at fighting machines than I am. Of course. I'll let you know when I'm in landfall. Thank you, Aloy. Okay, I'm gonna be fully ready, so... I should go. Of course. Before you do, is everything alright? It sounded like there was an... Uh, issue with Beta and the mission? Not anymore. We just needed to talk some things through. To understand one another is to embrace truth. And... Like I said, I'll let you know when I'm in landfall. We'll find the data you're after. I appreciate it. Forbidden Legacy. I didn't believe, but now I see. You truly are an ancestor reborn. A good omen if I ever saw one. I'm a scout for the expedition. Whatever I learn of this strange land, I will share with you. As is my duty to the ancestors. Much appreciated. They have none because I've been a good guy, a good boy on keeping up with all my... Alva said one of the diviners here might know where the Leviathan research facility is. Hey, Alva, I'm in landfall. Can you meet me here? I'll be there as soon as I can. 
Aloy. I'm here. I had to sneak past a few machines on the way, but I made it. All right. Ready to talk to that diviner? Yes. He's right over there. Diviner Alva, what are you doing back in Landfall? And with the living ancestor? We're looking for the At Bay Research Center, where Leviathan was developed. The legacy tells us it's somewhere in the city. Alva mentioned you've been collecting data in the area. Do you know where it is? Uh, yes, I stumbled across it, but there was no data there, only crumbling ruins. Tell us anyway. We might be able to find something you missed. Please, don't trouble yourself. I, I, I sh assure you, our search was very thorough. Mm, you're hiding something. What? That... that is absurd. A diviner must only speak truth, as you're well aware. Ooh, you're worried you found something dangerous. Something compromising on Eileen Sasaki? Keep your voice down. Look, I get it, Merrick. You want to make it back to your family, so it's safer to turn a blind eye. But think of Leviathan. How it could help everyone. Isn't that why we're here? Don't let fear deny us that. Very well. The facility's just south of here, along the shore. But even if you find a way to fix Leviathan, it's sure to be shrouded in that which is forbidden. Too often the truth is forbidden. Come on, let's go. Uh, I do uh, greatly appreciate how she, she's so bubbly and dope and, and just uh, excitable. Not bad with that diviner back there. You've come a long way since we first met. And Nerex, like I used to be, terrified of a misstep. And with the overseers, he has every right to be. But what I've seen and learned since the greenhouse, uh, it's so much more than what we're permitted. Diviners are supposed to seek the truth, and yet so much is kept from us. I'm tired of it. That should be the facility ahead. Oh, we need to find a way in. Up here. Well, Nerik wasn't lying about crumbling ruins, at least. Let's look around. Uh, Aloy, why is the ground shaking? That's not good. Whatever. Have I done any grinding for parts recently? Nope. Everything is right as it should be. Whoa, that, that thing is huge! We'll have to take it out if we want to find that data. Uh, okay. Now. I'm with you. I don't care about the parts right now, so... goes Whew. well I'm gonna have nightmares tonight we should be able to look around for that data now I don't care about the valuables I might be able to kick that vent open Data. Uh, yeah, 
I don't think I'll be able to follow you there. After you. Time for a swim. Mm, at least the water's not freezing. I mean, in California, I met the water was feeling pretty nice. Look at this place. I always try to imagine what it must have been like back when the old ones were here. It was less of a climb, I bet. Come on. Let's check the upper floors. <laughs> there, a console. It must have been what Nerik found. Let's see if it has anything on Leviathan. Oh, the data on Leviathan isn't here. Well, there's some kind of log. Delete the database. But Miss Sasaki, when you look at the reports, 3,000 exhibiting symptoms, over 400 dead. The data's clear. Omarama is contaminating the water supply, promoting bacterial growth. And with Leviathan based on the same architecture... You're a smart kid. Top of your class, right? My father built this company thanks to world-class talent like you. And you know what else is world-class? Our legal team. So unless you want to spend the rest of your career in some dead-end, underfunded public research institute, you'll delete that database. And forward all data on Leviathan to my office. Yes, ma'am. That was her. The ancestor, Eileen Sasaki. Hundreds dead. And she knew their system was to blame, but she had the truth erased. Were all the ancestors like this? Selfish, ruthless, immoral? And yet we hold them up as paragons of enlightenment and virtue. Given what we've learned, I don't even know if Leviathan will work. Hold on. Let's not give up just yet. You said before that the Old Ones use Leviathan to control flooding. Which means... it probably worked. We'll know more when we find the data on it. The recording mentioned a copy was sent to Eileen's office. And to their corporate headquarters. Uh, there. Let's go. It shouldn't take us long to get to the tower. Lead on. <laughs> so what was that other system the recording mentioned? Omu Ramba? The legacy tells us it was the predecessor to Leviathan, a system that manipulated floods to bring life to a barren desert. Quan seemed to know a lot about this ancestor. Diviner spent years trying to figure out how to restore Leviathan. We found a lot of data on Eileen Sasaki in the process. Though, now I wonder how much of it is actually true. Entrance is blocked. Gonna have to find another way in. The soldiers built a path on the nearby ruin. Might be able to cross over from there. Lead the way.
think this is as far as our soldiers got. We'll have to climb higher to get into the tower. I'll follow your lead. Let's climb. Up we go. There we go. You doing okay, Olva? Yes. Don't worry huh? about me. Listen, I'm gonna worry about you. <sighs> Glint talk. Great. Did it see us? I don't think so, but we'll have to be careful. How are we going to get across? Well, that beam looks promising. Uh, this is a lot higher up than I thought. And we're going even higher. Glint talks. Well, we have the element of surprise. Or we could sneak by and, you know, not fall off the tower. Good hit. I mean, uh, there. No more Glint talks. I've heard our soldiers say the Glint talks are the worst. Up this way. Climbing missions at night, always fun. Just don't look down. Right. <laughs> of course. Super easy. Here's the tower. Should be able to cross over. That doesn't we sound are going good. going to have to jump. Uh, after you. I gotta clear some of that debris first. Side. Made it. Okay, Alva, your turn. Right. Yeah. Aloy, can you watch me and make sure I do this right? Come on, Alva, you can do it. It's okay. Please don't break. Come on, we got you. Make sure Alva makes it across before I take a look at this. Oh, door's locked. You sure you're okay? Yeah. No, I'm fine. Let's keep going.
Maybe there's data around here that can help with the door? Oh. This says the code is the month and year the company was founded. According to the legacy, it was October 2023. So the company was founded in October. Which is the 10th month of Got the it. year. Got it. Door should be unlocked now. Cost reduction strategy. Yeah, We're talking about life people's life. lives here. I did as you asked on Omuramba, but this is worse. Relax, Eileen. I've spoken with risk management. They're confident that the chance of another incident is within acceptable parameters. We're moving ahead with Leviathan. You know, Dad, shortcuts have a way of catching up with you. Within acceptable parameters or not. Well, one day in the distant future when you're in charge, you can run things how you want. But until then, how about you let me worry about that? Guess Eileen and her father didn't always get along. But it seems like covering up Omoramba wasn't her idea. Doesn't matter. She still had a part in it. Well, let's keep going. Her office must be higher up. Uh, dead end. There's a ladder in that shaft, but it's blocked. I might be able to pull the rubble out from the other shaft. Let's see where this leads. Uh, you go on ahead. I'll look for a way up that has a lesser chance of falling to my death. Okay. Hey, Alva? Yes? There's something I don't get. You said Eileen was the one who built Leviathan, not her father, so... What happened? I'm not sure. The legacy doesn't say. Either that knowledge is lost, or... Forbidden. Or maybe we were wrong about that, too. Oof. Oof. Don't look down. a long way up. Whoa. Parkour. Now, how to get up higher? How about you, Alva? Any luck finding a way up? Not yet. Whew. Well, that's done with. Okay, I'm back at the shafts. If I blow up that fire gleam, the elevator might fall and open up a path for Alva. Hey, uh, Alva? Step away from the shaft. Okay, but whoa! <laughs> oh, I can reach the ladder now. Uh, be right up, Aloy. Looks like there's another floor above. Might be Eileen's office. Okay, I'll meet you up there.
Made it. Good job. I need to go down before I can go up. There you are. Come on. Let's see what's up here. Ooh, campfire. Quick save. Another locked door. Need to figure out the passcode. These artifacts. I... I think these were Eileen's. Oh, that must be the Larson McCory Award. The legacy says Eileen won it when she was 40. For her work on Leviathan. Interesting. This looks like some kind of prototype. For water purification. Must be the H2 flow. Uh, what? H2 flow. Their early inventions had strange names. It's art, I think. Could it be? Yes, I... I think this was commissioned in honor of the company's 25th anniversary. That must be the Dragonfly 6. Ape used it in most of their construction projects. The Dragonfly 6 was their most successful model. Huh. Focus might find something I missed. What was this thing again? The H2 flow. All the numbers you mentioned. I wonder if they make up the passcode. Yeah, it's worth 42. a try. Forty-two. What did you say this was for again? The company's twenty-fifth anniversary. Four, four Looks zero like it two. Used to be on the last pedestal. Two five. Oh. What was this called again? The Dragonfly Six. Forty-two two six two five. That did it. Okay. You can almost see the whole city from up here. Corner office. Impressive view. It must have been Eileen's. Let's see if the data on Leviathan is here. Well, it's official. Eileen Sasaki, CEO. Chair, and the worst daughter in the world. Security had to escort Dad to his vert. Guess we'll be speaking through lawyers from now on. Looking down at the world from here. It's hard to see the details. People become risk factors, statistics, <laughs> far too easily. Omu Rambo was supposed to provide clean water, improve lives. It was easier to pretend there wasn't a problem. Easier to believe the lie was truth. But I don't want to pretend anymore. I will build Leviathan right. No more shortcuts. No more lying just to save face. It won't undo our sins. My sins. But maybe we can still do some good. She overthrew her father, uh, took over the company, so that Leviathan wouldn't end up killing people. 
It sounded like she regretted covering up Omuramba's failure. She wasn't perfect. Not a paragon, as the Quan believe. But not a monster, either. She tried to make up for her mistakes. And now you know the truth. Uh, as for the data... Leviathan... Uh, yes, uh, it's here. Downloading a copy now. Is something wrong? I think I'll stay here a while longer. There's a lot more data that I want to look through. Are you sure you'll be okay on your own? Down is always easier than up. Let's speak again when we're back at base. Okay. I'll see you there. Well, after climbing all the way up, why not glide down? Wait, you're going to what? Just thinking about it. I wonder. Careful! <gasps> Going down. Yeah, I'm not going to make it. Okay, now since we landed. I'm glad you're here. I wanted to give you this for helping me get the data on Leviathan. I didn't really know what to give you, so I asked Zoe what you might like. Thanks, Alpha. I'll put it to good use. Have you looked through the data we recovered on Leviathan? There is much to sort through still, but I believe we'll be able to get it operational and turn back the floods. And I've given more thought to everything we've uncovered about the Ancestors. The Overseers would have us believe they were infallible paragons. But Pharaoh wasn't. Not even close. His greed led to machines that devoured the world. The archive of the Old One's knowledge destroyed, just to erase his mistakes. So, when we learned that Eileen had a hand in covering up hundreds of deaths, I started to think they were all the same. Selfish. Egotistical, cruel. But in the end, it's not that simple. The truth isn't a straight line of ink on a crisp scroll. It's a splatter, smudged and faded on stained parchment. I wish more Quen could see that, instead of looking the other way or twisting the truth to serve their own schemes. I doubt Bohai would agree with you. No, nor the rest of the Board of Overseers. As Eileen said, it's easier to believe the lie is truth, but it's worth fighting for. And this diviner, at least, won't settle for anything less. For that, I thank you, Aloy. I should go. Make sure you talk to Gaia if you have any questions about May your path lead to Okay. Can we talk for a moment, Aloy? Okay. Hey. We'll be going after Hephaestus soon. You good with the plan? I've already got the location of my assigned cauldron. Good. I heard you and Beta had a 
talk. News travels fast. It wasn't exactly a quiet conversation. There were just things that needed to be said. A healthy crop to those who clear the weeds between them, as the Utaru say. Oh, I also wanted to give you this. For helping with the land gods. Plainsong is in your debt. Thank you, so. You deserve much more for all you've done. May the land always bloom in your steps. And... yours? <laughs> How to go with the chorus after we fix the land gods? They were shocked when I told them that our lands would soon be on the mend. I thought Fane's eyes would pop out of his head. But of course they had no choice but to take it as good news. Even if it meant all their preaching about meekly accepting our doom was exposed as rot. To be honest, I found the conversation to be highly enjoyable. I'm glad. You deserve it. They're lucky that you never gave up on saving them. I should go. As soon as you intend to leave for Gemini, you'll hear about it. I mean, for once, the plan involves everyone. Aloy, you think we can talk? Yeah, bud. Hey, I thought I'd check in before leaving for Gemini. Are you sure we shouldn't be uh, checking up on you? I mean, whatever went on between you and Beta sounded intense. But not that I'm judging. <laughs> Forge knows all the screws flew loose every time Ursa and I fought. I think we'll be fine from now on. I'm glad to hear it. Oh, before I forget. Here. Something to commemorate our mission. We did good together. Yeah, we did. You should know. Silence is involved with the sons of Prometheus. He's the one who gave him the override tech to begin with. Why doesn't that surprise me? That's probably all part of some master plan, huh? At least we know we're good at wrecking those. Damn straight. I should go. Yeah, same here. I got a date with a cauldron to prepare for. Well, it's already full. Or it's already. Uh... So, we're fighting immortals from the stars now? Looks yeah. like it. What's next? Wizards from the moon? I mean, that sounds like a downstep to me. Aloy, are you well? Had a bit of an issue with Beta. It's better now, though. Ah, uh, I'm not surprised. Really? Why not? I once knew a warrior who discovered he had a brother late in life. It was deeply uncomfortable for him. Did he ever get over it? In time. But not before the two siblings nearly killed each other in a single combat challenge. Ah, well, at least I avoided that. For now. I bet people are curious about that new arm of yours. None more than our Quen ally, I assure you. She couldn't wait to take it apart and figure out how it works. I gave her the data I used to build the thing, hoping I would satisfy her curiosity instead. Good luck with that. I should go get ready. I await your orders. Okay. So that wraps up that. Again, we should be good to do another one in the next one. But thank you all for watching. I'll catch you all next time. Bye-bye.